Hello everyone, welcome back to... Guess who's doing what? It's Altrius playing Dead Cells because it's all I have right now. Okay, leave me alone. I'm not lonely. You're lonely. Let's try Shield Meta. I like trying new things once in a while. Shield is not that new of a thing to me, to be honest. Uh, neither, mind you, is the wolf trap. So, it's not the bumper, okay? That's Smash Bros. Try to do the Smash Bros. Shield. Every time. <laughs> I don't think of it as a secondary, well, weapon. It's not a weapon, you know? I'm just killing everything. Not um, necessarily advised, but I'm doing it. Don't know what I really hope to achieve today. We've already unlocked the, um, the vine rune and the, the obelisk rune, you know, the sarcophagus thing. So I don't really know what's left. What does this do? Hold, try to tap to try and parry and block all damage. Okay, so parry, parry does block all damage. I didn't realize that. Um, you know, many shields have a, a bonus on parry. So we want to try and get that. We first want a shield that has the bonus. Then we're going to try and get the bonus. Let's uh, increase our brutality because I expect that we are not going to roll with the shield for very long unless we get a particularly good one. Which seems unlikely. I did. I think I did block all damage. Nice. <laughs> I think you get uh, better returns out of that if you tap as well. So don't hold the button down, it seems to be the, uh, the rule there if you want to. Okay, Becky. Automatic attack. Meh. Meh. I'd sell it if I could. I think we're going to keep what we've got. Good to practice. It's also good to practice playing on spikes because apparently we suck at that. Um, sure, let's buy an ice grenade. Don't mind the occasional ice grenade. What happened at the end of the last run? We had skills that didn't do as well. That was the problem. I, I mean, the skills did us fine. It was just... The, um, the the enemy that we're up against that we tried to use skills against didn't really suffer fools gladly enough for that to work. Uh, I don't know if I want to do the sewers, not with no weapons I like. Um, there is something above the shop. Maybe not somewhere we want to go. So, we did learn that just throwing traps at the boss doesn't entrap the boss. True. However, we also know that skills are usually the way to the boss's heart. It's nice to occasionally just have the opportunity to get that right. You know, even if it's not strictly necessary, just pressing Y instead of B in order to block with the shield instead of roll can be good. I assume that many things like um, magical attacks, for example. Oh, I'm not gonna... Do I want two grenades? I don't think so. I don't want one grenade right now. Um, not gonna be blocked by the shield. Have you seen this? Dirty bed. Abandoned ages ago. Oh. Actually, a family of rats seems to call the place home these days. Hidden hole. I mean, should we talk about it? A devious little fellow made a passage for himself through the wall. Cool. Good on you, mate. That's what I'm saying. Secret zone discovered. Mushrooms? Powder. All kinds of mushrooms have been carefully ground down to find multicolored powders. Pretty sure they weren't using these to flavor the soup. Jar of mushrooms. A variety of differently shaped mushrooms are proliferating in these jars. By the looks of them, they should have some interesting psychotropic properties. Good old Dr. Tom here must have been supplying the whole prison. And a chest. Seems to be where the mushroomologist stashed the profits from his little business. Da, 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 da. And we get a sinew slicer, which I think is probably better than the wolf trap for my purposes. No. This way around. Yes. LTRT. Sign. Thomas Place. Prisoner and Doctor of Mushroomology. Oh, we didn't know his name was Tom because we didn't read the sign. But we still knew his name was Tom even though we didn't read the sign. It's fine. My immersion is not remotely shattered. Been dead for a while. 
Wait, that, is that the Surf Sir Is that the same one that was recently dead the last time we looked at it? Is that a different one? Also, somewhat looked like the person we were talking to in the um, in the early game, teaching us about the place. We will put more in the assassin's dagger so we can have it later. Uh, I'm going to scum it up. You can't make me not. Okay. I know that we do really well if we um, take the DPS one. But I told you, you can't stop me. Stop trying. Let's... Did we get the... Uh, I think the Assassin's Dagger is what was up here, right? Okay, so now it's just, just money. But it is money, you know? It makes up for the fact that we bought something on the last floor. Not appreciating the vast lack of DPS we get from uh, shield and crappy sword meta. Let's not go down there. It's a silly place. This will be the time door. Yeah. Well out of order. Sorry. We don't need it. It's not... If I wanted it, I would have gone for it earlier on. You know, you know that there's a time door. That was good. I actually attempted to shoot it. <laughs> With my Frost Blast or similar. Nice. I think parrying might actually be my best technique at the moment, simply because my sword is gash. I wouldn't mind any upgrade <laughs> besides a scroll. You can't uh, press the shield twice in a row? Wow. Absolute rubbish. Did I just sh shoot upwards? Slash upwards, I guess. Get out of here. Definitely does way more damage to those things if you just send their thing back at them. Have it you. Then it's just trying to smack them with this terrible sword. Uh, you see, I would like the Frost Blast, but I can't do damage if I take it. And I'm trying to make the shield work, but, you know, I can't make the shield work without the field work. Which actually makes some sense. Because I want to break free. No. Ooh, hello. Oiled sword. That's good if you like fire. Which I kind of do, sometimes. I can like fire. Do you like fire? I don't really want to go this way, but I'm glad I did. If I had teleported, I wouldn't have got the uh, blueprint now. And at least I don't have to fight the elite with this rubbish setup. Appreciate that it stuns the enemy, which means I get a little bit of an opportunity to have a go at it. But um, <laughs> appreciate that it's actually super difficult to actually achieve. Where the heck is the thing protecting all these? Why are you down there? It's far too far away for you to be having an effect. There we go. Arty. Oh. Ow. Yeah, heal. <laughs> Got a lot of things to sort of try and make do with, which is mostly my own fault, but I want to be able to do it when I don't have to make do with it, you know? I want to be able to... Uh, rather, that's not quite what I meant. I want to not be making do with it when it's the only real thing I have. There is a rack. I'll get more out of... Your use out of this in the guard's will. It is an infantry bow, which is great. Let's take it over the sword. I'm going to read the order of the king. You can't make me. It was, um, yeah, it's a comfort zone thing. If we don't figure out shield meta, then there's going to be no point in unlocking most of the shields for a start. And then on top of all that, there's going to be, like, a time when the best thing that we could have had was a shield, and we passed it by because it was not great. Because <laughs> we don't know how to do it. Wolf Trap 3... I mean, I might as well buy it, you know? I can recycle this for a small fraction of the price I paid. And we have not much money left, but at least we have a decent trap. Which just improves the previous trap. Might have been better. I completely agree. It might have been better just to buy something else. But, um... We should play with combinations we're not used to for the same comfort zone reason that I'm playing with the shield in the first place. Okay. 
Yeah, I crit on those for close range stuff, which is grand. Day. Just do that. <laughs> Get out of here. You. Stop. Enough. I press the Smash Bros. shield button again. How is the muscle memory of Smash Bros? Well, I haven't played for six years, maybe? You know, I haven't had anyone who plays Smash Bros with whom to play Smash Bros for six or so years. Yeah. But now I just want to take this and this. And do you know what? Because I haven't had a decent shield back, um, I'm going to abandon shields for now. Come back to it when we when a shield is a better idea, I suppose. I mean, there's a lot of shields that have just good features, and this is not one of them. So, and we're not going to get a good one from oh, excuse me, from the starting zone until we unlock better things in the starting zone, and we haven't yet. So, there is that. Now just remember not to uh, not to try um, blocking things because we can't do it anymore. Ooh, hello. We are here for these. We must remember that. Oh, don't forget also the infantry bow is a full red build now. We do get some uh, benefit from the green part of the. Pay the tribute or turn back. I have outraged the gods. 25? No one said that. When did that happen? Get out of it. <laughs> Gotta love how as soon as you can't get hit, not getting hit is the hardest thing in the world. Get out of here. No, you did it. Last time I watched this game, that gave you 10, like the other one, which, to be fair, I still didn't make, but come on. This corpse is always... Uh, I don't want to sell it. <laughs> I just want to pick it up. Um, a corpse is always there. Why? I'm very upset, because I had a decent build. I just ignored that. It's fine. So, let's try and... Get a little bit further. That's the whole point. We'll kill this thing because it has a shield for me. No, not a shield. What's this called? A bow. I took survival first because I want more HP. <laughs> Early on. I don't think I need to take Instar this time, which is going to be good because I was suffering a little bit from the fact that I didn't have um, the... the... The DPS boost when we kill something. Which one does rely on sometimes. Or did we? Maybe we did. I can't remember. Oh, I did. I think I did that time, but I didn't time before, so ignore me, I'm just bloviating. Go down. 45 seconds. There's way more to this floor than 45 seconds worth of stuff. And I'm not going to pay money for a boring grenade like that. Even if I have plenty. I do. I guess that's the nice thing about dying with all that money, as I did get to keep a lot of it. You're gonna, like, take some damage. Very upsetting. Should have probably shot it. My bow is doing better than anything else right now. Which kind of makes sense, because it basically has twice as many shots as everything else. Sort of a legless bow. I love how this random dead guy with body of a yet another dead guy. Might be the same person. Might be your own body. I don't know. There is a... Sh Let's go. <laughs> don't be bothered walking around. I don't think we have... Well, we might have time to get to the... Uh, orange juice. I said I drank the rest of it, and then there was a tiny little drop. And I, I just had to have it. Um, Not many cells. Assassin's Dagger. What am I playing with? Yeah. Backstab. Nice. Let's get one of those. This is a good time to get that. Yeah, give me that. Place that. Hooray! You give me combo. I like combo. And we will start putting 
putting stuff in red, I guess. Red and purple. I know I put one in green and that's it. But red and purple. Oh, wait. That means we only got one... Yeah, we only picked up one scroll on that whole floor. It seems weird. I'm sure we picked up two. There you are. Um. Hmm. Probably should have explored a bit more. But I did get this time door, which makes up for it with this plus all the other stuff. Hmm, maybe it makes up for it. There's probably a faster way of exploring the floor in the first place, so that you're more likely to have explored everything before, you know, it's a problem. I usually stab things in the back anyway, because things tend to try and shoot me from in front of them, so... The assassin's dagger seems to sort of play into my hands, to some extent, so to speak. Kill it. There we go. Seems to have really short range, though. Maybe that's the, the kick. That's the uh, downside to it. Can't believe I lost the run where this stuff heals me. What a plonker. That's nice. I do like that. That's good. It would be nice if it caused you to take a, to get a crit on anything that you use to attack in the, from behind. But no. That would be way too buffy. I don't mean Buffy in the Vampire Slayer way, I mean Buffy in the too much of a buff way. I haven't watched the Vampire Diaries for ages, I got really bored of it. It's all on Netflix. I don't know if it's all on Netflix, but the stuff that is on Netflix is what I got bored of. It. So if there's any more, it's like, just stop. What is it with American TV shows? And just incessantly making more and more? I understand the obvious answer is they get money for it, so they're going to keep doing it. Will you stop turning around, please? You know what, this would be a uh, great way. Uh, shit you not. This would be a brilliant synergy with the Ice Blast or something similar like that because if the enemies stop moving they can't turn around and then you can definitely stab them in the back several times. Also it, it synergizes really nicely with the uh, Wolf Trap here but I guess that's not that big of a deal. Stab! Stab! There we go. Um, like the Wolf Trap stops them from turning around but as we've learned with the boss effects have diminishing returns and uh, as we discussed I don't know whether that is the boss that has more immunity as the time goes on or just any enemy the more you attack it with the same things the more it becomes immune to it you know we might not have needed to throw that much at the boss in the first instance right maybe if we have good skills like this we excuse me um, we save them up because we're capable of beating the boss in the early stage. It's the later stages that are a problem. Then we'll know if the resistance is because you used it too much or because the boss is just naturally resistant to it in later stages. So I think that's what we might try and do this time round, provided we get to the boss, which hard to suggest that we won't. Do. Good opportunity to um, shoot it before I attacked it. I will take the, the damage the primary stat there. We want to up our primary stat as much as possible while we're not in a dangerous position in terms of HP because <clears throat> later on we're going to want to make up for the fact that we are um, in a dangerous position in terms of HP. Oh, excuse me, by taking HP. But the more we can get in damage, basically, the longer it will be before HP is a problem because as things... As we all know from any other roguelike that we may have played in the past, the faster you do damage to something, the less likely it is to hit you. So this is where you do a roll in mid-air. There we go. Oh, hello. Nice. We have got an electric whip. Which I do not think is very good. And I do not want it. Thank you. Appreciate the, uh, the intent. But the execution leaves something to be desired. Aha! I think we take the ice grenade because we don't have a second thingy. And also, I'm really enjoying this assassin's dagger. We will take more red, even though it is not the most HP. Again, the more damage you do, the less HP you need. Until enemies start doing a full one hit. Hey, over here. So your fight is pretty impressive. Did you... did you get it? Yep. Yeah. Excellent! I'll give it to me. 
Uh, no. <laughs> I said, give that to me. No. Middle finger you, bro. I knew it. You're just like all the rest. You'll regret this. Will I fight this thing at some point? Maybe. I thought I'd found a secret, but I just happened to break some scenery. I'm so excited. Do keep an eye out for uh, those um, runes in the walls. Because they seem to be a bit few and far between. I would very much like them to be lesser. I will just straight up replace that with that, I think. The only difference is that it does damage to frozen target, which we can do with our other skill. So it's not the end of the world. My skills, I think, have similar... Yeah, you know, they're not far off from each other in terms of timeout. So we might want to... Oh, we need to go to this teleport. We might want to go for the mutations that in reduce the timeout of both of our skills. We have one of each. Uh, unfortunately, that's yeah, two mutations, one for each skill, but I guess you can't win everything. Okay, okay good. Bad. None of that. I was behind you. It's the first hit I've taken in this whole run. Not whole run. Might be the whole run, actually. Probably not. Can I have that, please? It is what doesn't kill me. It's another mutation that I'm not quite sure. The mutations I find, I like, again, I'm not played this game long, and I'm not a game designer, so I'm not saying I'll do it differently. But I have no idea how valuable the mutations are. It seems like the three that you start off with, like the obviously the comeback from the dead mutation is outrageous. Is this just better? Yeah. I will spend my money willy-nilly. Will he, nil he. You can't stop me. And also, it's that's what it's there for. <laughs> just spend it. Um, uh, the first three that you start with, the uh, Isdar Ilgatuk tack thingy, and also the DPS one that we've got, they seem great. Our church, great. But I can't get behind any of the other ones. I don't see the, the value of them. I can understand maybe some of them, because they obviously scale with, with the colour that they are. Um, I can see that there is some reason to them. Because uh, the, the effect gets better the more that you do it. But I suppose we might as well. This is a weird sewer. It goes upwards. Sewers don't do that usually. Um, Because... Just saying. It actually made it possibly with enough time to get through the ramparts to the time door. So we're going to try that. We've got 11 seconds. Uh, 22 seconds. I just don't really find him that amazing. Like this. Okay, that seems pretty good actually. <laughs> but you have to be close to a deployed skill, right? So we want both of these. Um, I don't know. It always strikes... It's a bit like interest rates. In the economical sense. In the banking sense, you know? Unless you're earning so much <laughs> that interest rates are like... Like 1% is a formidable amount of money... What are interest rates for? This is not fair. I can't get to the time door because you put an actual bullshit in my way. Did you see that? Never before have I seen such an edifice between me and the next part of this thing. And all of a sudden... I mean, I'm going to take the one that does damage and HP, right? All of a sudden, the first time that I have had the opportunity to get to the time door on the ramparts, except for that one time when we had like five seconds, which probably doesn't count, I had to. Ah, crap! Leave me alone!
Yes, more of this. Get over here. Roll. Roll, turn. There we go. That was extremely unfair. <laughs> By the way, where the hell is the time door? Excuse me. Poisons enemies that wound you. I was hoping it was saying poison heals you. Not really into just... Revenge is not my way of doing it. My way of doing it is to not get hit in the first place. I'm glad that I took the extra HP option this time around. I didn't mean to do that, but damn it. I tried to roll past it, but it wouldn't let me. So, that's what I'm gonna do. I appreciate this bow, by the way. Because of the fire? <laughs> the fire is great. Wow. This has been a uh, bastard of a level, quite honestly. That elite was in the worst possible place because I couldn't get to the thing that was artillery because of where the uh, elite was. The elite was in between me and the thing that was causing me to not be able to attack the elite. That might have been better, but I want to use slowing meta because we have damage on frost and frost sort of next to each other. Cool. We really need to start using our skills that much more because it's got to that point where we just can't manage on our own already. Please roll. Second time. Why are you not doing nice things? I'm wondering if the... Uh... Do you know what? Apart from that time I had the... Um... The uh... glitch on the rumble pack. I don't know if I actually notice this rumble pack work which means it might be that the reason I'm not getting a subtle hint when I can roll again is that the subtle hint is not working didn't think of that is that everything here maybe yeah I was hoping for more but at least we got stuff let's get out move on I've used both my heals, which is not good. The ramparts is usually reasonably easy. Especially compared to... Wow, look how far away it was. There's no way I would have found that in time. Even if I've been going hell for leather, there's too much stuff in between me and that. You need to come back with, like, at least a full minute to spare to get to that. Well, maybe not a full minute. I'd say 30 seconds we've put in it, though. That's good. There we go. Roll, please. The fire is great. Making a big difference to a lot of things right now. For example, things that have seals. Just don't bother with this. <laughs> that was terrible. I didn't realise I could actually be stunned for that long, to be honest with you. There we go. Although that fire lasts for ages, which is great. It actually killed something up there. Kebab, please. I know that you like to give me merciful kebabs every now and then. Ooh. Where did that go? <sighs> Thought it fell down the hole. <laughs> like you better get back here right now. Um, I mean, there's more HP involved, so let's just do it. Uh, it's not like we didn't get. It's not like we got zero HP from that. But I was tempted to just keep swapping between the other two until... Stop that. Um... Uh, yeah, until I got as much HP as I could out of the uh, whole situation. Wow, you go far. The uh, bow is not fast enough to do that. <laughs> now we might want to go for a plus 27% HP. I would very much like kebab right now. Kebab right now. Kebab right now. Uh -huh. Ooh. You got anything good? What is this? Generates a shield unused. Less damage received. 
sure. Spend all my money. Don't care. I've still got more money left than I'm going to be able to take with me for the next run, so what the heck ever. Yeah, I'm I'm aware of the uh, the red vignette that all games are doing now when you're heavily damaged. Unfortunately, I can't just hide behind a rock whilst the Germans shoot at me. Um, and, and <laughs> wait for myself to heal. Not how it works in this game. You took ages, and I don't appreciate it. Hmm. Any, any, <laughs> any um, bone you could throw me, probably with a kebab wrap around it, would be great at this point. Oh, game master, a fearless leader. Yeah, 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 yeah. Also, this. My cooldown time on grenades is insane now. 7.8 seconds from, what, 16, 18 that you started at? Boosh. Nice. Feeling a lot more confident now that I'm not imminently dead, but I've still got, you know, 4 of 13. Not very many percent damage, uh, HP. 4 thirteenths of my HP left. Just keep doing this. Burn, baby. I hate these ones. Because they go so far that you have to run and chase them <laughs> in order to be able to hit them. Oh, wait a second, they're blinking well turned around again. The bastards. It's okay. Just this. There better be a rune. No, no, no rune. Okay. Okay. What is. <laughs> Jen thinks asking for kebab was to her. No, the game has kebabs for HP. I don't need more food, plus. <laughs> she heard me shouting about kebabs. Message me from downstairs. Do you want a kebab? Not really. We have this, um. We learn that Jen's allergic to wheat and other um, wheat-like grains. So just not rice, basically. It's rye, wheat, barley, spelt. Spelt! That's the thing. Turns out you can get spelt flour, which is spelled F-L-O-U-R. <sighs> These commentary is not worth saying. Order of the King. Another order from the King to his officers. If the cells are overpopulated, use the outdoor jails or the oubliettes. You've no suspects unsupervised. Suspects. See? The thing about these kings is that everyone's a suspect. I saw that. That was nice. I appreciate that. We have more like that. I will use my dagger from in front if that is what is necessary. I guess you could jump over it, but... Not all cases. I'm going to just use this. <laughs> In not all cases, is it necessarily possible? Uh, why is there no... There's a sinew slash up there, but I'm gonna leave it. I don't really need it. Um, so we had... We keep trying different types of pasta, basically, which is... Kind of goes against my philosophy, which is that if you can't have something, have something else. <laughs> you know? But, um... It, we've got this one made of peas. Green pea flour. I'm going... Green pea... What do I need? For, so two more items. Okay, I'll put something in here. Um, the pasta was fine. Initially. Went like immediately after it was cooked, although it did kind of turn into mushy pea. But it didn't taste bad with the... Sauce on it. Just normal crappy shop bought pasta sauce, right? But then when it goes cold, it's revolting. <laughs> it's absolutely unimaginably revolting. I'm into this. More of this, please. Ah! I hate that because there's absolutely nothing you can do about it. Pretty sure you can't. Uh... 
pretty sure you can't roll through it. We tried, haven't we? I should be using these less because, as I said, we know how to deal with the enemy at this stage. Also, we have both with fire. Yes. The other thing is I'm not just spamming it with um, as much as I possibly can of my... Um, uh, trap there. You know, I'm trying to use it a bit sparingly. It's not strictly necessary that I'm constantly like keeping it pinned down, you know? If we need to, we will spend a trap opportunity in order to heal. I'm not averse to that. Please switch off before you get to me. We don't need to yet, so keep your hair on. I appreciate the damage over time that we get from things like this bow, because the fire is very useful indeed. Right, so let's do this. Come over here. Yep. That was very bad timing. That's okay. Ah, oh, no. Quick. Good timing. Ow. Keep missing out the, uh, the different attack animations. Kind of pesky. Keep confusing them as well, but what I'm saying, like, not missing out on them. Sort of missing out on what they are. Let's do it from the far for now. So it seems like we are managing to at least hold it down for a little bit longer. Than. Oh, no. Don't do it like that. Don't do me like that. Get stabbing. I <laughs> can't even. Have to do that. I think we might have this down, but I'm not <laughs> convinced just yet. Uh, our crits from that nonsense that we're doing to it are outrageous, but we keep sliding through it. We've done it. <gasps> Finally, we've got the heavy crossbow blueprint, which I'm down with. And... Boom. Permanent daily challenge, prisoner's quarters. Senior slicer 3L. Shots leave a trail of flames. Shots pierce the first target. Victims in a toxic cloud. That's really good. I think I will take it over the ice grenade. Yes. Correct. And... I'm going to split this episode. Uh, this is not common. <laughs> but, uh, I can't keep doing hour-long episodes at the end of the day. Maybe it's for our live, eh? Well, you know what I mean. I'm the blacksmith. Hello, the blacksmith. I work with the collector next door. Cool. So if you've got the cells, I can improve your gear. I do have the cells, but not right now. We'll do that later. Uh, I'm going to split this episode. Thank you for watching. I... Four minutes, good grief. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. I hope you've been enjoying the series so far. And I hope that you'll be joining me in the future for more Dead Cells. But until the next episode, thank you for watching this one. Thank you for watching the series. Thank you for your support. And I'll see you.